I'm just doing some daily chores. Maybe you want to come along and join me. I cut my hair again. It's not the haircut I want. It When you cut your own hair, you um, sometimes cut and cut and cut a little bit more. In a week, it'll be way too long again, so it's okay. And it doesn't look bad. It's just not the person I want to be. Today, I have to do some exercises and whatnot because I have to. I have to start weighting these. I have to put a backpack or something with weights on myself so that I can get bigger. But in the meantime, <clears throat> I'm just going to do this and it's been a while. So I kind of have to catch up. I really should, I was going to say, I don't know. There's a lot of things I should do. I don't know what they are. Okay, and then, then I'm going to do some push-ups here. Yeah, there's... I mean, that place is a little messy, but it looks okay. I do way too many rests in between. <clears throat> you have to squeeze your butt really, really tight, especially with my lower back issues. <sighs> Yes, it has been a while. <sighs> really, that's all I do. I need to do other stuff, I guess, but I'm glad I can just fit that in. I've been so bad lately. <sighs> okay. So I'm going to make my bed. So many electronics on my bed all the time. That's not a good thing to do. That's something you should remove your electronics from the bed room. Shouldn't even have a TV in there. Can you believe my toy walls? Ooh. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I really do take too long of rests in between, but I always exhaust them. I'm not going to do a full-on bed make. I have one, two, three, four layers going here because it's winter time. So to make your bed from scratch is not easy, but this should be okay. I wasn't doing any 
major rolling around in here. I got a, a couple of balls in here. My back has been hurting me, but I did uh, some of these exercises, which I didn't really, but I think lower back problems can actually be, from what I've seen on the internet, a weakness in your butt. So I really should do more butt exercises. And I saw this on the internet. And when you do this, or then you just hold it up, push your foot down, and you push back, and it does relieve the tension right away, which is cool. But I think if you keep doing it, you will also strengthen your butt muscles. And I'm sorry about my email. That's my email, not yours. Why am I talking so weird today? A mail. Quit mail. This is just one giant live stream of me doing my stuff. I wonder what I'm going to eat today. I really like custard. It's my last eggs, though. I might have maybe a salmon. Salmon and pork rinds. I just mash up salmon and make it like a, a paste or a pate. And I'll dip pork rinds in it. That's something I do sometimes. Yesterday I treated myself and I actually bought cheese. I have laid off on the cheese and I think it is making a difference. I think too much cheese made me a little fatter because I do look, I noticed yesterday, pretty slim. But I still think I'm too fat. And don't say anything about that. I mean, I know I'm not fat. But there's still fat on me that I don't want to have. But my butt is still kind of jiggly. And kind of want zero fat. And I would like more of this. I probably should do ab exercises too. I just don't have time. I don't have time. I don't have enough time just to do the push-ups and stuff. Should I do a full-on pillows down? Maybe I'll make another video after this, sitting in bed. I'm going to put all the pillows down. I have a technique now. I put this one in the back, or one of those in the back. And I'll put, whoa. These two, one here, one here. Those ones are filled with toys, of course. And I'll put this one here. Oh, and then I'll put my normal pillows. Oh, no, I won't. I'll put one normal pillow here, one normal pillow here. No, I mean not normal pillows, the square ones. And I'll put that there. And this here. And I'll put that there. And I got this giant pillow fest. Which I probably should just... Oh yeah, that's the stuff. I also have this towel that I use to lay on my head. I replace ever so often. What do you think of the hair? It's so pointy and military. The line was too in. So kind of a cone head, but it's, it's not horrible. So I can live with this. I'm not afraid to go. And when I wake up in the morning, my hair looks good, opposed to before it looked horrible. So this is a good backdrop. Okay, I'm going to do some more exercises. And wow, this really was me talking. I'm going to make it go for the whole 10 minutes. So we've got 30 more seconds. What else can I show you? Oh, I could show you this mess that I also have to clean this mess up on my toy reviewing table. I'm going to get an extra one of these things. Oh yeah, I put up this curtain. It looks so good. 
I guess there is a room makeover video kind of this I don't like that looks too stupid uh, that those things I need to get another white one and then I'm gonna raise up this curtain in the bathroom because that's at a dumb why am I being so negative bad negative words don't use bad negative words it's not at a good um height I need to put it right up to the ceiling and it'll look better I also need to get finials for the edge of that, just small ones, so it stops the rings from falling off. And yeah. <laughs> look at the toy wall. Masters of the Universe and Ken's. Tough in fashion, tough in models. Love you guys.